So today is going to be a fun video. I'm going to be testing loads and loads of pairs of jeans because honestly, finding the perfect pair of jeans is a mission. I feel like it's pretty much impossible at this point. There's always something wrong with them. So I thought for today's video, I'm going to order loads from ASOS. We have quite a few different brands and I'm going to try them all on for you guys. Do like a little first impression review on each one. Let you know what sizing I picked up, the pricing of all of them. They're all pretty affordable. I think the most expensive pair I have are around £40 and the cheapest are around £20. Um, but I'll link them all down below in the description box in case you want to go and pick any of them up. They're all from ASOS, like I said, because I feel like that's the easiest place to get them. Um, but yeah, let's get on with it now and I'll start trying some jeans on and hopefully I find the perfect pair. I've just laid them all out on my bed. So we have quite a few different washes, quite a few different style of jeans as well. So let's start trying them on. I've seen so many people talk about Stradivarius jeans, um, but I've never tried them myself. So I thought in this little like haul testing video, I'll definitely try a few pairs. So this is the first pair I picked up from there. Super, super affordable. I think these were £19.99, which is such a good price. Fit is amazing. I got these in, I think it's size 8, I'm pretty sure. And they come in both petite, tall and like normal. These are the normal version, which I'd say is like a length 32. But honestly, in love. They fit really well around the waist. I know a big problem with jeans on me is that they always have like a gap at the back whereas I feel like these fit really well around the back but then also like the bum and the thighs area. Also I apologise for the creaky floorboards, they are very annoying, I know. They have quite a bit of stretch in them for mum jeans so they're super super comfortable. I feel like I can sit down in them like have a good meal and I'm not going to be like having to unbutton the top button which happens a lot with me in jeans. They come up really nice and high waisted as well. I have a thing with jeans, they always say that they're high waisted and then I try them on myself and they're not high waisted at all. I think because I'm quite tall, I have like quite a long torso. Yeah, so so far I give these a 10 out of 10. So this is the black pair, they're more of like a faded black though. I just put on the black pair to film some little try on clips, um, but I thought I'd tell you quickly that these definitely come up bigger than the blue pair. I feel like I could afford to size down um, another size, so this is a size 8, but I feel like there's quite a big gap like at the back. Um, Next up we have another Stratovarius pair of jeans. I always struggle with the name of the brand. The amount of takes I'm going to have to like cut out of this video because I've pronounced it wrong. Um, but yeah, so this is another pair from there. They're kind of like the full length straight leg wide leg dad jeans. I feel like they're very in this kind of summer. I'm not sure if I'm trendy enough to pull them off but I'm going to try. So here we go. This is what they fit like absolutely love them, I think the fit of them is amazing and um, they're kind of tight around like your waist, your bum, your hips, the top of your thighs and then they go down slightly flared but not like a full flare you know. Size wise I have these in a European 36 which I think is a size 8. They also come in tall and petite, this is like the normal version. Um, I would say they are quite long so if you are on the petite side maybe go for like the petite jeans or even if you're like normal height kind of five foot five i'd probably opt for the petite jeans unless you want them like super long and you plan on wearing heels with them um but yeah really really cute they fit nice kind of around the back around the waist and the bum they definitely have a denim material feel to them um but they have a little bit of stretch in them i'd say they have these in quite a few different colors they have like a light blue with rips they have like a faded black pair as well but yeah i'd rate them a good nine out of ten i'd say my only thing is i'm not sure if they like suit me in terms of the style but yeah i think they fit really well if you're looking for this kind of pair of jeans so these are the Stratovarius like 90s dad jeans again, but they're in like the faded black pair. Um, again, really, really like these. I'm not sure exactly how I would style them. I need to look up pictures on Pinterest because Pinterest is my go-to. Um, I always look up like how to style different items on there. Maybe I'll insert some pictures on the screen so you guys can get some ideas as well because I feel like wearing them like here now, they don't look the best, but maybe once they're like styled up, I could look cool and trendy. So these are the ASOS Farley jeans. Now me and Farley jeans, we go way back, you see. I've had quite a few pairs from there over the last few years. Some I've loved, some I've tried and they fit horrible. They're very inconsistent with the like sizing and fit of them. Um, but I thought I'd pick these up because they looked nice on the model. Price wise, I think they're around £35. And size wise, I get these in a waist 26, length 32. But like I said, they're very inconsistent with the sizing. So I have other pairs of Farley jeans, which are in a waist 28. Um, so it's definitely a bit of trial and error if you're planning on getting like a different pair. Um, but these I absolutely love. They fit really, really well around like, the bum and the waist 
um, there's no like gap at the back which is what we all want with jeans i feel like they have a really nice like waist to bum ratio so really good if you have like an hourglass figure or you're a little bit more curvy they do sell out quite fast and um, so i'll try and link these down below hopefully they still have sizes in stock i do have the same style of these with rips in the knee which i'm sure you guys have seen before because i wear them all the time on my instagram i'll insert pictures i've had them for like or five years now and they are coming to the end of their life which I'm very sad about because they don't sell the exact pair anymore but I feel like these are as similar as they get I can always make rips in the knee if I want maybe I'll buy like an extra pair just so I can recreate the ASOS Farley jeans I have from like five years ago which I'm still obsessed with um, and I also have these in a blue pair as well which again insert pictures of me wearing them because they're one of my faves yeah. Right, no, they're not carrying on. Okay, these are ASOS straight leg jeans, I think they are. They're like slim, straight leg cropped jeans, but they won't go on. They're a race 26, length 32, so the same size as the rest of the jeans I got in this video, but just, can I put them on? Oh my God, okay. Right, let's try and zip them up. Okay, they actually do fit, but they just, yeah, I don't think they're the ones, are they? This is what I mean, they always list them as high-waisted, but this isn't high-waisted to me, like high-waisted is up here, um, so they're just not flattering. Um, I mean, yeah, I'll link them down below anyway, in case you are a straight jean person, because I do think these kind of jeans look nice on a lot of people. I'm gonna unbutter them, because I don't want it to like ping off, and I break them and I can't return them. Okay, I can't actually unbutter them. Oh my God. Okay, there we go. Right, yeah, so these will be getting returned. I really like the wash of them though, but just not the ones for me. So I'm including these as like an honorable mention because I didn't actually buy them in this ASOS order. I bought them a few months ago, but they're sold on ASOS and I love them. So I thought I'd mention them in this video anyway. They're the Topshop mum jeans, but they're like the tapered slim fit. I think they have like the original mum jeans and then they have these ones, which obviously have more of a tapered look to them. And I'm obsessed with these. You guys know I love them. They used to be called the Topshop Premium Mum Jeans when they were being sold on the Topshop website. They're like the perfect jeans. If you haven't tried them yet, please just order them. Try them. Like you can return them if you don't like them. But I promise you, you will. They have a little bit of a stretch to them. Um, but I love the fact they're actually like a jean material. Because I do sometimes find mum jeans and skinny jeans with like stretch. Are just sometimes more of like a jegging material. Which I do feel like can look a little bit cheap sometimes. Where Whereas these, they're a proper jean material, but they have a stretch and they're super comfortable. Like, we can squat in them, we can kick in them, you know. They have a bit of movement, we can dance. Not that I dance like that. Um, but yeah, love, love, love them. Flattering on the bum, there's no gap, like, at the back, at the waist, which we love. Size-wise, I have these in a waist 26, length 32, and they fit perfect on me they have them in a few different shades as well there is a slightly lighter blue wash they have like a black wash i think they have like a dark blue wash as well maybe even a white wash um okay another pair of jeans that i can't actually get on maybe if i breathe in oh my god oh, okay let's do the thingy up Ugh. so these are the asos Ridley skinny jeans if I'm being honest, they're not my faves. I just don't think they're flattering on me. It's another pair of jeans where they're marketed as high-waisted jeans. But are they high-waisted? No, I'd say they're more like a mid-rise. They're also quite small for the size. They're more of like a jegging material, which is not my fave. So yeah, I'd say if you're searching for a good pair of skinny jeans on ASOS, go for the Topshop Jane jeans. They're my favourite pair of skinny jeans and avoid these ones, I'd say, because yeah, they're also not flattering on the bum at all. These are another pair of Topshop mum jeans. I just think Topshop jeans in general are like one of my faves. They always fit really, really well. They're good quality. They are a little bit pro than some of the other jeans in this video i think they're more like the 40 pounds 45 pound mark but i just really rate them they always last a long time so i thought i'd pick up this pair of mum jeans with like the rips in the knee which again i love they're a little bit more of like a baggy pair of mum jeans compared to like the tapered and slim fits of the other ones i've been showing you um but yeah really really like them they fit nice around the waist they're in a waist 26 length 32 um i feel like you can dress them down with like trainers and a little hoodie or you could dress them up with like a little top and some heels maybe a blazer over the top i feel like that could look super cute as well 
but yeah i really like the wash of these as well they're in like a light blue bleach wash um i'll show you them up close link them down below but let's move on to the next pair or i don't know if this is going to be the last pair i haven't decided like what order i'm going to put the jeans in when i edit this video so this could be the last pair you see there could be another pair afterwards um you'll have to watch and find out so i really hope you enjoyed this video let me know your favorite pair in the comments if you plan on picking any of them up or if you have any other recommendations of like really good jeans uh, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already give this video a thumbs up and i will see you in my next one bye